We're at 1103 here at Palms. Elevators are behind me. It's a non-smoking room. It's a corner unit. Similar to the pictures. Two beds in here. Ceiling fan, which is nice. This comes furnished. You got a flat screen TV. So air conditioning unit for this room. And the Anderson Ocean Club, where you stayed, is this yellow building right here. So we're looking down on Ocean Boulevard, heading north. This unit's uh, unusual. I don't, I don't see this very often. This one actually has a balcony on the boulevard side of the building. It's screened in. But you've got a view this way. A big vacant lot there is where Myrtle Square Mall used to be years ago. They tore it down, I think, around 2003 or 2004, if I remember correctly. We got two beds. Uh, the carpet is, you know, kind of this industrial style carpet you see in a lot of these units that are rentals. Uh, it looks to be in pretty good shape. I don't see any stains or rips. I looked at one similar to this on the third floor, and it's, uh, it's in pretty bad shape compared to this. Normally, a lot of these will have tile or linoleum in this area since it's the kitchen. Uh, this one's got this carpet. Uh, it must be fairly new. Anyway, here's the kitchen. Kind of a galley kitchen here. These are not the original appliances. This place was built in 89. I'd say these were probably redone in the mid-90s, maybe. Um, I'm sure there's a date or something in here. But, I mean, surprisingly clean. Uh, the fridge is old, you got rust on it, being on the ocean front, that's not unheard of. Anyway, galley kitchen. See the ocean front there, we'll get there in a second. Um, bathroom here. Again, linoleum on the floor, and it looks fairly new. There's me. Hi. So we've got a tub shower here. Three window or three windows, three mirrors. A cute little bathroom. Uh, you can kind of tell the ceiling height from the bathroom's a little bit lower. Um, I'm 5'10, so this is probably seven foot ceiling in here. It's probably closer. I can't reach the ceiling standing on my bare feet, but I'm almost touching the ceiling here, about eight feet in here. And then it goes up again in here. Um, but enough shots at the ceiling. Uh, here's the living area. Yeah, the furniture looks to be fairly good, especially for a rental unit. Another window here. Let's kind of see the building next door and then back out to the boulevard again. It is a very dreary, rainy day here at Myrtle Beach, so I wish I was doing this with the sun shining, but can't win them all. Anyway, living room, couch. Front this up. Should have a Murphy bed right here. Oh! Oh, and it does, but the mattress is kind of stuck back in there. But got a Murphy bed. If this chair wasn't in the way, I'd pull the whole thing down. TV center here. And then the beautiful yet right now chilly Atlantic Ocean. So we've got a nice balcony here. Um, chairs and a little table. I hope you're not afraid of heights because we are on the 11th floor, but since this building has a mezzanine and a first floor that's above the ground floor, this is really the 13th floor or 14th floor. But it's labeled 11. And here's the beach. A flock of seagulls down there, not to be confused with the band. Lady walking, but not a whole lot of people on the beach today. It is January. 
people next door here either live here permanently or are snowbirds. They had a Christmas wreath up and a Bob Humbug doormat. Pull back out. Look down. Um, there's a little jacuzzi. Directly beneath me is an indoor pool. And the Palms is a two building complex. Here's one building. We're obviously the second. They've got an oceanfront pool down here. And boardwalk out in the beach. Um, really, really nice condo on the oceanfront for $80,000. Unfortunately, it's just not that nice of a day. It's about 55 out. Anyway, I hope this answers some of your questions. Uh, I'll get this off to you as soon as possible.